So we've got this fairly old Dell 720XD. It uh, we run six four terabyte drives. It's our set A and this is our set B. Set B is just plugs and we back up to these and then we take these off site in a fun little 3D printed carrier holds the drives. And then uh, we take this set off site and put the other set in here, clear all the backups out, have to back everything out. Anyway, this thing's been complaining about power supply issues. So it's got a single 750 watt and it picked up a couple of these uh, used 1100 watt 80% Dell power supplies. I'm going to try to hot swap one of those in. I know this is like the simplest server maintenance ever done and might be pretty silly to make a video of it, but I've never done it. So this is the guy here that might be the problem. It's a 750 watt that came with a server. Um, I think I can just pull this plug out here and uh, slide this new supply in and give it a little power. Let's see if we get a green light. Well, so here goes nothing. We're just going to take this uh, oh, no blinking. i got to wait until that's done blinking. Hmm. Well, I guess, worst case, we just have a hard restart, which it's survived before, so I'm going to unplug the existing supply, see if the machine goes off or stays up. Oh shit, it's off. Okay, well obviously i got to learn something about that. Well, blinking green says, according to the little diagram here, it says mismatch, whatever that means. So, um, it's, it is coming back up though. It's got a lot of little blinky ears over here. Anyway, going into the uh, life cycle the BIOS and we'll see what's going on with that. Well looking at the uh, BIOS for power supply slot number one, um, everything looks pretty happy of it. Firmware versions 9.13.59, um, update as today's date, and if we look at the other one, Power supply slot 2, 9.13.59, same firmware version, and same update date, but they're both still blinking, so I don't know what's going on. Maybe I'll just do a hard power off, maybe that'll take care of it. So looking at the life cycle log, I think this is the problem here when it went down. It says uh, system holder because the power exceeds capacity, so maybe it's not possible to put an 1100 watt power supply in this chassis. Maybe there has to be something uh, uh, maybe something has to be changed. Let's see firmware update will not be performed. Placement part was chosen. So like this one here, well the date's obviously messed up on that. This is the type of thing, type of error I was seeing on the original power supply. I mean it's obviously running on the new power supplies. It seems crazy that it would not work because I put better supplies in it. There's the other power supply problem there. Uh, well, 
Who knows? I guess it'll try a hard reboot. Now, interesting is I rebooted. It says the power supplies. This was a soft reboot, just exiting the life cycle controller. So it maybe just rebooting will fix it up. Not very encouraging. Both the new supplies are still blinking green. Well, I did a shutdown from the OS, and um, you know the computer went off. There were some lights up front, and the power supplies were blinking. I went, ran an errand, came back. Situation was still the same. So I unplugged both power supplies push the power button on the front to make sure everything was drained and then plug everything back in. When it came back up, um, the life cycle log shows the power supplies here is informational and they seem to be happy. And around on the back side of the machine, power supplies have solid green lights on them. So that's all good. The strange thing is that in the uh, um, in the hardware configuration screen which we looked at before and hardware inventory and view current inventory um, before I was looking at the the power supply showed up in this and you can see the firmware version and stuff um, but now it does not appear to have power supplies in here as far as I can tell there's the drives and all sorts of things. The power supplies were near the bottom here. <laughs> They're just not there anymore. So, um, who knows what that's about. So I think I'm going to try to do another hardware shutdown and see if it'll pick this up. But the lights aren't flashing, yay. But there's... And the life cycle controller knows about the power supplies, yay. But it's weird that the hardware inventory doesn't. So, I think there's a setting I can have it find the hardware inventory. I'm going to try that. Well, I guess as long as we're making a video, might as well make a boring video. So it says collect system inventory and restart. Oh, it's already enabled. Huh, that's weird. So I would expect it to have got the system inventory. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to do with that. I guess I'll try one more reboot. I'll let you know what happens with that. Well, I did another reboot. And uh, basically, I let it boot up into the OS, told it to shut down, then uh, pulled the cords, pushed the power button with the cords out, put the cords back in, and came back up in the lifecycle controller here. And uh, then I did hardware configuration, hardware inventory, view current inventory, and at least a second ago when I tried it, it knows about the power supplies now and the power supplies are not blinking. Let's check that. Power supplies are not blinking, yay. So, I mean, the only thing I've done, I haven't loaded anything, but now if you come in here and scroll down, there's a PSU slot one. And I think this is the same as when I first installed it, that 1939-59. I don't think it did any firmware update. So, as far as I can tell, um, basically just a couple of hard power cycles seems to have brought its brains back. So, I'm going to call it a win. Um, so that's uh, basically somebody who's a complete novice at this stuff, swapping out a couple of power supplies. Uh, basically did a couple of uh, hardware reboots and uh, well I did let it sit I did do one hardware I went to the OS shut down let it sit for about I don't know 15 or 20 minutes while I ran some errands maybe half an hour uh, they were blinking that whole time but then after a true hardware reset um, they weren't blinking anymore so um, seems happy so I'm gonna call it a win thanks for watching